The brunette beauty flashed her cleavage in a semi-sheer frock, which featured a dangerously low-cut neckline for the star-studded bash. The racy number featured a black mini dress with a pretty sheer polka dot overlay, which was decorated with frill detailing on the hem and bust. Karen's enviably toned legs were impossible to miss in the see-through number and were further accentuated by a pair of patent black heels. The 35-year-old from Venezuela accessorized her monochrome attire with a quirky, fluffy scarf, which was styled across one shoulder. Her short, ombre locks were left in loose waves while she opted for a dusting of bronzer and a slick of lipstick. When Strictly Calm Dancing's Karen Clifton stunned in a semi-sheer frock when Karen accessorized with a quirky, fluffy scarf some of the biggest names in show business descended on the pavilion event space at the iconic Tower of London for the Beauty Awards with Oak now in its 16th year, the glitzy night attracted a host of stars including the cast of The Only Way Is Us, Strictly Come Dancing and Made in Chelsea. The event opened with a speech from OK Magazine editor-in-chief, Kirsty Tyler, chairman of Daily Express Newspapers and OK Magazine owner Richard Desmond and his wife Joy were amongst the notable 700 guests in attendance, which was hosted by beautiful Britain Escott talent judge Amanda Holden. Getty Karen and Kevon were reported to be barely speaking after this year's series BBC Kevin thanked his wife for putting up with him on this year's series Karen's solo appearance comes after husband Kevin thanked her for putting up with him during this year's series, after he and Susan were eliminated from the competition on Sunday night's show, he told host Tess Daily I'd like to say a couple of thank yous actually, when Strictly's on, I'm not the easiest person to live with, I go a bit mad. So I'd like to say, first of all, thanks to my wife for putting up with me. Kevin's apology came after it was reported that the dancers were barely speaking, a source told The Sun Kevin has spoken to some of this close to him and admitted things aren't going well between them at the minute. Strictly Calm Dancing continues Saturday on BBC One at 7.05pm.